In primetime news this evening, bail act tabled in the lower house as government pushes legislation intended to help contain crime. Prime Minister insists things going smoothly in relocation of Bernard Lodge farmers. And some farmers in salt ponds and Catherine still not able to access their fields after flooding in the area. Good evening and welcome to Primetime News on air and online at onespotmedia.com. I'm Herman Green. And I'm Janela Precious with a preview of what's the coming business news. Here's Andrea Chisholm. Well, Janela, it's a Wednesday, so all eyes are on the latest gas prices. Will they be going up or down? I'll have the details in the business day. Okay, and Jermaine Brown is also here to tell us what's coming up in sports. Jermaine. Well, thank you, Herman. And I can tell you that the West Indies, well, they went down to Australia in the first the T20 as they get ready for the World Cup. But there were some booming boundaries in that match. We'll tell you all about them a bit later on. Uh, there's also sports commentary, E-Prime and weather in this newscast. But before the break, the feedback question. A question this evening. Do you believe a gun amnesty can help to reduce crime in Jamaica? Give reasons for your answer. You can share comments online, facebook.com slash television Jamaica and tweet us at television jam one. Please stay with us. Primetime News returns right after this break. <laughs> 